and my uh, followers, subscribers. Um, just thought I'd uh, catch up with you and see how you're doing. Um, I hope you're not out and about and uh, getting saturated in all this yucky weather. Um, just thought I'd update you. Uh, for those of you who have seen this is the first video you're watching of mine, I have been searching for my birth mother and in my last video I got an address for her and so I'd uh, written her a letter. So that's nearly three weeks ago. Um, but as yet, I've not heard anything back. So over the past three weeks, there have been two or three postal strikes. So at the beginning, would have delayed her getting it because she's at, down in uh, London. So uh, yes, I would, I'd imagine that a lot of these strikes are going on down south. Uh, I don't think there is much up here because we are still getting posts. Are you still getting posts in your area? Let me know in the comments below. Um, I've got my nice cup of tea that my uh, other half has made me. So yes, that's where I'm up to with that. Uh, as I said, I've not heard anything back. It's nearly three weeks. Um, she might not want to contact me. She might not want that contact, that connection. And that's fine. I'm saying that's fine. We'll see in a few weeks. Uh, but I have got one final, um, not way of getting in contact, her, in, in, in contact with her, but I've got another way that I've got a couple of questions that I would like answering. So I know who I can go to for those bits of information, but they're, they're the last resort. So I'm probably going to leave that till the end of the month. And um, we'll see what happens then. So as this is going to be one of the last vlogs, videos, whatever you want to call them, with regards to searching for my birth mother, um, I don't want it to mean the end of me posting videos. So I'm looking at ways on still being able to post. So hopefully it's not going to be all inane dribble, dribble, whatever. Um, so I thought for my next video, um, I would read the first chapter of a book I wrote and self-published on Amazon back in 2015. Now, my book's called In Just a Minute, and it's uh, in the genre of chick lit, and it's got a bit of a twist at the end. So, that's going to be my next book. I'm going to read you the first chapter. I hope it's a bit more than just one page. But even so, you'll get a substantial amount, so uh, you can decide whether or not you want to buy it and download it and read it for yourself. Um, so let's see how that one goes. Uh, I also want your comments and feedback on that. Not only in my comments here, I'd like your comments on uh, Amazon because that'd be brilliant. Um, YouTube, YouTube. I've been looking at the amount of subscribers I've got and the amount of views I'm getting for my videos. So with that in mind, it's when you look at the algorithm, I'm looking at probably 35% that, um, that, that I've only got, that are only subscribed out of who's watching it. So I need to build up that other 65%. I need the other 65% of you who are watching my videos to actually subscribe. It really doesn't cost you anything. It really doesn't. I'm not going to do membership and I'm not going to do Patreon because uh, my content's not going to be worth that kind of... Um, you, you, I can't, couldn't see how I, you could get any extras from that. Um, so yeah, I'd love you to subscribe to my channel. 
I would also like you to like my videos um, because you're watching them but you're not liking them or disliking them so and I would really like it if you start clicking the like button when I watch a video and there's quite a few I uh, subscribe to and watch and I always find that so I don't forget as soon as I click on the link I bring it up into a bigger screen and I click the like button that way I don't forget um, it just helps all the fellow youtubers with their algorithms as well so if you can do that and then the icing on the cake for me would be if you would comment I would really love some interaction from you so if I'm saying to you all what you've been up to or you know what do you think about this that and the other right drop me a message let me know what it is you're doing I would really like to know that I'm also asked after picking your picking your brains I've got this unruly mop of hair normally it's about this short but it's not it's all grown and I haven't been to the hairdressers in years but the thing is is I actually don't know what I want to do I don't know if I want to change the colour I don't dye it this is all natural uh, so can I have some, some suggestions as to that please I would really like it so until my next video which will be in the next couple of days with me you'll find me reading the first chapter of my book in just a minute I will see you then and you take care and I'll see you in the next one bye bye